Crystals, a family of five, letting go of 90% of our stuff in pursuit of experiencing big life with less. If you are new to our channel, hit that subscribe button and turn your notifications on to keep up with our journey to full-time RV living. Good morning, guys. Happy Monday. I am just getting up. The kid girls came in, woke me up. My house is a wreck. I feel like ugh, I need some coffee. So, ugh, here I am. We're almost still asleep. I'm hoping I'll stay asleep so I can get my makeup done and stuff. That's why I'm talking really quiet. <laughs> we got quite a few things to do today. First off, it's gonna be me getting ready because I feel like a hot mess. Put my makeup on because I'm vlogging all day. Today I wanted to do a typical day in the RV and I would say it's not starting out as a typical day because Armour is normally up by now. Uh, but he woke up at like 6.30 and I ended up giving him a bottle and I went back to sleep. He went back to sleep so he must be really snoozing. So I'm going to go ahead and get dressed, make my bed, do all that kind of stuff and then we'll get cooking the kids breakfast and then we have a whole lot of stuff to do today so it's time to get today totally started. I'll be You're done with them? I'll be you want them on? I'll be Look, just sit them over there. Sit them in the hallway. What? Sit them by your slippers. By those slippers. That? 
No, your socks. That? Yep, sit them over there. Exactly. Tommy, go potty. No, over here. Over here. Come on. Come on. Let's go. Come on. Comey, let's go. Come on. Come on. As we look up at the stars in the sky, did we ever stop and wonder why? We let our love shine all through the night. Just you and me, babe, until the morning light. The morning light. Good morning, sleepyhead. Mr. Sleeps a lot. Hi. What you doing? You just get it up. You want some breakfast? Boogie boogie butt. Bum, bum. Oh my goodness, I cannot wait to see what this is like. The one thing I don't like about my vlogging camera is that it doesn't have a screen, like the screen kind of like angles back, but it, I can't see myself. So I don't know if I'm ever in focus or if it's good lighting or anything like that. I just have to wing it and then watch the video after. But anyways, I just went on YouTube and I got some new settings for my camera and I'm super excited about them. I can't wait to see how it goes today. But I've been avoiding, I basically was doing that to avoid cleaning ah, I hate cleaning it was the same in the old house like I didn't enjoy cleaning there and I don't enjoy cleaning here you know like we have the same like the thing about an RV is that you know you at home at a in a normal house you know a 1400 square foot house you can get a whole bunch of stuff out and there is a ton of surface area whereas in here you can get the same amount of stuff out and it seems like you know you have nowhere to move so it's so like i love to keep it clean in here so i do make sure i keep that as a priority so currently i'm gonna go ahead and pick up i'll probably have to do this again right before chubbs comes home but i just need to get it done because then i'm gonna have to get all the laundry together because we're doing laundry today so it's laundry day so i'm gonna go ahead and stop avoiding my cleaning and get this done the kids are screaming this is my normal life, so I'm gonna go ahead and do this and I'll update you guys here in a few minutes.
right, guys. I have gotten most of the laundry organized. Most of it. I still have this up here to tackle. Let me show you. Woo! Like I said, if you've watched my vlogs before, we use this as a laundry hamper. I need to get all the stuff down from here. This is the longest I've went between laundry times. I am about ready to go to the laundromat. But first, I have a couple more things I need to do. Like, adjust the camera. <laughs> and I am going to try something today. Is a lot of stuff goodness gracious that's a lot I need the truck keys hey guys I am here at the bank now 
Hold on. All right. Maybe I need to adjust. The thing about driving this big truck is it's hard. <laughs> That's basically it. It's freaking hard. So I need to get money out because I almost thought I didn't have enough money last time I went. And I regretted not getting more. And I only have like four or five quarters left. So I gotta do this. I gotta do this today. I'm ready to go. I'm trying to talk myself out of stopping to get some coffee at the local coffee shop down here. I've been wanting to try it. So I'm trying to convince myself it's not necessary, but I'm leaning towards it's necessary. This thing's just so long. I mean, it doesn't bother me because this truck serves us a purpose and there's absolutely no reason for us to have two vehicles, right? Okay, uh, <laughs> I don't know what I was saying, but this truck basically serves us a purpose and there's absolutely zero need for a second vehicle. So it's just like, I can't justify getting rid of, or like to get another vehicle until we come back. Now when we come back, you best believe we're getting another vehicle. We're getting a van, I want a van. I need to make sure this place is even open. Okay, I have a few minutes. I have a few minutes. Yes. This looks so good. Chocolate graham cracker smooth. What? I'm gonna get this one. Hi. I would like this. And then, do you guys have cold brew? We do have cold brew. Can I just get a small cold brew? Do for cream or you just black? Just black, please. I got this house blend chocolate graham cracker smooth. Oh my gosh, I'm still in my iced coffee. <laughs> and then I just got a black iced coffee, which I need because I mean I have a couple hours ahead of me here at the laundromat. All right, I've arrived at the laundromat. Looks like there is a ton of people here. I'm gonna go. I don't know. Assess the situation. I guess it can't be that. But there's a lot of washers at this one. This is like my new favorite one. I was going to one on the north side of town, and it was nice. Um, it was a nice one, but. I found this one and I like it. So let's see, let's go in and see if it's like crazy packed. Cause if it is like, maybe these people will be leaving soon. I don't know. Um, you know, maybe they're on their drag cycle. That would be nice. <laughs> I mean, even if not, it's okay. There is a ton of washers here. Yeah, there's plenty. There's like a whole row of the big multiple load washers and that's the one I like. So I'm gonna get my wagon set up and then I'm gonna start taking stuff inside.
everything in the washer. This is my most I've ever washed at the laundromat. Um, I don't, I can't, I've lost track of how many I've used. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Eight, eight wash machines and I'm doing like the big ones. So I had a lot of laundry. So now moving on to the drying portion and then my least favorite thing, folding. I have, let's count. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Eight dryers going and I still have two more loads over here. Last five minutes on the washers and then everything will be to the dryers. What's up? I am back home, got all the laundry folded, got it put away. That was by far the most laundry I ever did at one time. And it's whatever. Thank God it's done. I don't have to worry about it for another two weeks. Probably, let me, let me look at my calendar. Yeah, I'll probably have to do it or like a couple days before we leave because we plan on leaving two weeks from today. So probably the end, like the 17th, I'll have to do it again. But so I don't have to think about it for another week and a half. So anyways, I'm just sitting here waiting for my live training to go live, catching up on emails. I did see that someone joined my team today, so I need to get her set up. I need to get a post written, all that jazz, get her welcomed. I feel like I haven't even looked at my phone hardly today because I've just been cleaning, getting stuff ready to go to the laundromat, and it just was a busy day. When I feel like when I vlog, I don't really get on my phone because like I'm constantly vlogging and who like do you want to see me on my phone all day i don't think so but i do have to be on my phone right now because i'm about to premiere this training on facebook here it is I'm wondering what is mf mf stands for the magic formula the magic formula is a facebook group dedicated to providing people free value on how to be successful in the network marketing industry you can find all the links in the description area. this training is specifically for your network marketing business. I broke down these six goals into three different categories, business goals, action goals, and life goals. Obviously business goals is going to be pertaining to your business, maybe your income. Yeah. All right guys, that is a wrap on today. Even though some things today maybe didn't go as planned, that's like every day. Every day never goes as planned. You have to just wing it and go with it. And today was a absolutely wonderful day. I loved it. I'm so thankful the laundry's done. So thankful I did not have to do that for a while. I'm going to go ahead and wash my face and I'm going to go to bed. I'm going to end this vlog. I will chat with you guys next time. Bye.